Today we're talking about improving digestion. If you often experience bloating, heartburn, stomach aches, or have abnormal elimination patterns, this doesn't have to be a normal part of your daily life. You can actually do some things to start making improvements. We're gonna go over that here today. So first and foremost, start by chewing your food thoroughly, okay? A lot of people start to try to rush and they're just kind of cramming food in, maybe chewing once or twice and down the tube it goes, right? You wanna start helping your stomach, digestive system and everything with chewing thoroughly. So sometimes they even suggest up to 20 times for each bite. That can be a lot, but you're gonna notice some better digestive patterns if you can start doing that. Next sit in a relaxing place to eat. Now, a lot of times I'll tell people if you're at work and you're really rushed and you're just trying to get things in, try to take an extra little bit of time and eat away from your workstation. So you wanna try to be able to get into that rest and digest mode, right? Because if you are super stressed out at work or you're super stressed at home or you're on the go trying to grab food from somewhere and then cram it in while you're driving or something like that, your cortisol is up high. What's happening is when the body is stressed like that, you are in a sympathetic state. And so blood is going everywhere else but the stomach. We wanna make sure that we're a little bit more in that rest and digest mode where the, the body can kind of do its work that it needs to in the gut. So try to find a nice place where you can sit down and just relax a little bit while you're eating walk after you're done eating. Now this doesn't have to be anything long. Sometimes I'll just suggest like getting up and walking around your house, get up and walk around your desk, or if you can, get outside for a five to 10 minute walk. What this does is increases motility, right? So if you think about it, when you're eating and you're sitting down, as I suggested before, it kind of just sits there. But if you get up and start walking around, now we're kind of working everything with gravity and you're gonna see motility work a little bit better. You can try doing apple cider vinegar before meals to help increase stomach acid. This is gonna increase breakdown of food, okay? So a normal healthy digestive system uh, has uh, hydrochloric acid that is released by the, the stomach lining. This helps to break down food. This is what you need in order for it to, you know, move through the digestive tract a little bit easier. <clears throat> apple cider vinegar helps do that. You can also take digestive enzymes, okay? Again, along with that uh, healthy digestive system comes along with the pancreatin enzyme. So you wanna be able to break down protein. You wanna be able to break down carbohydrates and fats. This is all really important so that food isn't just sitting in the stomach and fermenting, okay? So that's another way you can go about it. So these are two, um, <clears throat> I guess, supplements that I would suggest, apple cider vinegar and digestive enzymes. Next. Consume more whole foods, less processed sugars, less sugar alcohols. Um, uh, you know, there's still a lot of information out there about sugar alcohols. However, it can start to disrupt the gut microbiome, okay? Um, and if you've ever had too many sugar alcohols, you might be someone that notices some changes in your digestion. Um, if you're that person, then you'll wanna cut back on that. Um, processed sugars, those can start to ferment in the stomach. Uh, they can kind of disrupt the gut micro microbiome. So you do wanna make sure that you're eating a little bit more whole foods. Lastly, take a look at your fiber intake. That's gonna help move things along as well, right? It's a binding agent and will help elimination patterns. Usually for females, I'm looking for like minimum of 20 to 25 grams a day up to maybe 35. Um, males, we're looking for minimum of 30 to 35 grams a day, upwards of 45 or so. So that's a nice starting point. So if you experience any type of you know <clears throat> abnormal um, digestion, then give some of these a try and see how that works for you. <laughs>